So here at Oak Ridge, we're developing a series of technologies that will be useful for capturing and converting carbon dioxide. One of the key things we need to do to mitigate climate change is to reduce the amount of carbon dioxide that we put into the atmosphere. Uh, and one of the ways we can do that is to pull that CO2 out of the atmosphere when it's already there. We would also like to find useful things to do with that carbon dioxide. So there's a range of chemical products that today we typically make from fossil fuel uh, starting points, but we'd like to be able to make them from carbon dioxide. Now this is not an easy problem, there's, there's a lot of difficulties, but there are technological routes to do these things, and so those, those are some of the challenges we're working on. We're trying to do research that will help really revolutionize how the economy works. We want to move over the next coming decades to an economy that is uh, net zero carbon emission. There will be many parts of the economy that will still emit carbon dioxide. We will absolutely need to do that. And so we need to develop a suite of carbon negative technologies that will help us in addition pull CO2 out of the atmosphere to offset uh, those existing sectors of the economy. Well, these are problems of global significance that we're working on. And it's really exciting to see uh, all of the different groups in society that are interested in solving them. You know, obviously individual people want to address these issues, but also there's tremendous uh, interest in industry in finding solutions to these very difficult problems. And so it's a wonderful area to work in. One of the things that I worry about in this area is simply the scale at which things need to be done and the speed at which we need to do them. So we're working on developing new technologies, but we have to immediately be thinking about how do we scale those, let's say to capture hundreds of millions of tons of carbon dioxide a year. And that, that's a really daunting prospect. Yeah, I think for young people that are looking for rewarding careers to work in uh, climate science or the technology related to uh, low carbon solutions, this is a fantastic area to be in. That, you know, we really are going to have to change almost everything in our economy to address these global issues. And we need bright, young, energetic people to do that. So I hope that perhaps some of the people watching will consider that for the future.